Welcome back to Primetime News. A special welcome to those of you watching online at onespotmedia.com. It appears the list of people connected to sacked Education Minister Ruel Reed and who benefited from contracts from the Caribbean Maritime University, CMU, is getting longer. At this morning's sitting of the Public Administration and Appropriations Committee, PAAC, questions swirled about Reed's alleged driver. TVJ's Anthony Lug has more. Last week, the Public Administrations and Appropriations Committee learned that a St. Anne counselor had also received a catering contract on the CMU's Career Advancement Program Youth Empowerment Solutions Project, CAPIES. The counselor is from the same Northwest St. Anne constituency former Education Minister Ruel Reed had intended to contest. In addition, it was revealed that one of the CMU's key collaborators is Mr. Reed's business partner. The business partner, Balford Peart, is the man the CMU said asked it to pay for services for a party for Mr. Reed to settle a debt owed to Mr. Peart. But the list of names connected to Ruel Reed appears to be growing. Today, opposition member of the PAAC, Mikhail Phillips, tabled some questions. Is Devon McQueen hired by the CMU to supply meals for the CAPIES program? Was Devon McQueen employed by the Ministry of Education as a driver to the former Minister of Education, Royal Reed? But if there was any truth to the questions raised, the sacked minister's ship is sinking deeper as the scandal unfolds. From matters involving one of his former household helpers who had received a catering contract to another who was paid about $4 million from a contract an overseas consultant had with the CMU. But let's go back to the name Devon McQueen raised by Mikhail Phillips earlier. His colleague Fitz Jackson had more questions. This Devon McQueen that he made reference to that was uh, this hired by the CMU, we want, I'd love to find out if he's employed anywhere else in the government service at any other high school, um, etc. Because I think somewhere it was alluded that he was employed at Jamaica College also. So I want that to be to be um, verified. Okay. While he was contracted at CMU in addition. In the meantime, CMU President Professor Fritz Pinnock is currently on six weeks leave of absence. Mr. Phillips also questioned about his travel expenses. Did the CMU pay the travel expenses up for Professor Pinnock and other senior executives at the CMU to attend the launch of Education and Help Foundation launched in early 2018 in Florida. Anthony Log, TVJ News.